Nearly 30 local women from all walks of life are getting ready to close in on one big goal in every way possible. These ladies are from Team Island Jane. They are also getting ready for a big weekend. They will be competing in the annual December Key West Triathlon, also known as Tri-Key West. This morning I'll talk with one of the founding members of Team Island Jane. Allison, thank you so much for being on with me today. Thank you for having me. Allison, have you ever completed a triathlon before? No, I have not. <laughs> <laughs> so this is going to be your first year, but I know all of you ladies have been preparing for so long. We have. We, when we first started this, most of us hadn't even finished a 5K. So we started really training in August, and we enlisted the coach and co-founder of Tri Key West, Amy Bradshaw, and she started working with us and developed a plan for us to train and to get us up to speed so that we would be ready for this weekend. So we've been training since 1st of August. So you're ready to go. I think so. <laughs> better, better be. <laughs> well, what's so great about this is that you are trying to complete the goal of finishing a triathlon, but you also have a goal of raising as much money as possible for Samuel's House. Tell us about what this is really all about. Well, we've developed such great friendships together as women and we've grown together, but I think the biggest part of that is that we were able to do something even bigger and better than get in shape, which is to give back to our community and give back to other women in our community. We talked with Samuel's House before we got started and sort of understood that they ne really needed an upgrade to their current security system. And we couldn't really think of anything more important than security, and for especially for a women's shelter here. And so we decided that that was what we were going to take on and try to give them. Um, as we worked and trained together to do this triathlon. So that was really what our goal was, was to try to, do, to give them a security system. And with the help of Fausto's, they actually provided some used security equipment. We are going to be able to give them the much needed security system upgrade. That is so awesome. Yes. And now people can still get involved in helping you raise even more money, of correct? Of course, of course. There's a couple different ways. Of course, you can always donate directly to Samuel's House, or you can uh, log on to Razoo.com, and Team Island Jane has a site on there, and we are all individually doing fundraisers that all rolls up to a team fundraiser for Samuel's House, and all the money goes to Samuel's House from, from Razoo.com as well. Well, I know that all the ladies at Samuel's house are going to be absolutely thrilled when you guys cross that finish line. We're thrilled too. <laughs> <laughs> now, you mentioned that you all have gotten really close through mm -hmm. this. Are you going to do some more triathlons this in the future? Is, this is <laughs> simply the beginning. Um, mm -hmm. It's only going to get bigger and better from here. We We have already started to think of things in our minds that we want to do and different events throughout the Keys and, and on upward that we want to try to be part of. And there are many of us and we have a lot of different interests. So some of us will continue to work toward bigger triathlons, potentially even Ironmans. And some of us may continue just to do marathons and, and occasionally do a triathlon in the air. Who knows? But the sky is the limit and uh, this is only the beginning. That's so awesome. So. Friday night, how are you going to prepare for this? <laughs> Boy, that's a loaded question. I really don't know. We, uh, I think in talking with all the team members today, I've really been on the phone with them all morning long. Mm -hmm. And we all feel pretty good. Um, we're all very excited. We're all ready to see this through. Uh, we're starting to envision ourselves at the finish line, and we're starting to really just step back and enjoy the moment together and to really wrap our arms around the ladies of Samuel's house. and and just uh, celebrate together. We're really focused on that celebration at the end of a huge goal and many goals accomplished because we all had major personal goals that we wanted to accomplish 
And so everybody's accomplishing them, and mm -hmm. then we're accomplishing this even greater goal for our community. So it's just going to feel really, really good on Saturday morning. Well, great. Well, I look forward to seeing you at the finish line. Thank you. I look forward <laughs> to seeing you as well. You can check all the action out tomorrow morning at Higgs Beach. Try Key West will get underway at 7 a.m. Now, for more information on Team Island Jane and how you can help support these women, check out the website you see on the bottom of the screen. That's going to do it for me today. Thank you for tuning in. I hope that you have a great rest of your day. Take care, everyone.